Twitch. Hello YouTube. Hello fans. It's the Geeky Minecrafter here, and although it's dark and I've just finished a little ma uh, housekeeping over here, I am getting ready to uh, do some mining, and I thought you might want to join me. Huh. Not sure what's going on. Hello. I apologize. I have had some technical difficulties this morning. I installed some new drivers to try and resolve one of the issues and created two more. It just goes to show you, even though you're a geek, you still have problems. So we're going to try this again. Relaunching Minecraft. I've got the uh, display drivers back installed. And uh, hopefully we <laughs> won't crash as soon as we start uh, doing anything. So I, I'm not going to add it to the video. I'm not going to go back and edit it. Uh, basically what you've missed is a little introduction. Let me recap that. Um, I am the Geeky Minecrafter. I have done a little bit of housekeeping, a little bit of farming. I haven't made you watch that. Uh, got my food supplies ready and... Uh, I now have uh, my hot bar set up and my inventory set up, and I'm ready to go downstairs. Oh, my goodness. Yeah. Oh, goodness. He was not loving life. Okay, I'll tell you what. Let's, uh, let's make a couple of changes here. Uh, that's supposed to be on 80. Apologize for this again. I am trying to trying to work out what's uh, what's what. You know, there's a lot of settings, a lot of different moving pieces involved, and uh, you know, there's no one clear cut course on how to set all this up. There are some suggestions, but everybody's computer is different, everybody's setup is different, and it's about. Uh, it's about finding what works best for what you have installed. So my apologies. Let's see if we can't get this. Um, right, let's take this down to get that down to minimum. Might speed things up a bit. Okay, let's see. Okay, so this is my potato farm. I have just mined a bunch of potatoes. I have some in here uh, baking. Uh, like I said, I, this is part of what I do. Every time I come in Minecraft, I just do a little maintenance. Uh, I harvest all the wheat. I harvest all the potatoes. I bake the ones I can. I, I put the rest up. Uh, we have some carrots. I have some uh, mutton and steak going, some pork chops, you know, because you can never have too much of that stuff, right? Going down uh, down in the mine whaling on stuff, you, you get hungry. So got some pumpkins up there. I haven't found any melons yet. I, I do definitely want some melons, uh, but don't have any yet. So, okay, I think I have everything. Oh, I just have the one pick. No, that will not do. Although it's an efficiency five pick, it is. Oh, what happened to my? What happened to my other pick? I wonder if I left it down in the mine. I tell you what, I don't have enough uh, levels, but I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna go down there with just one pick. That's just crazy. So I'll, I'll take I'll take this extra one. I would prefer not to use it because I do definitely want to uh, enchant it. But uh, stupid zombie pushed me in the lava. Uh, snuck up on me and pushed me in the lava while I was working down here. So I uh, lost a bunch of levels. I'm trying to make those up so I can go enchant some more stuff. Oh, why doesn't this have a light? I hear a slime. Oh, hit him with the chicken. Yeah, that's going to do something. Uh, let's see here. Here. I don't see you. Where are you? I get a bunch of zombies that come in right down here. Well, he sounds like he's real close, doesn't he? I mean, like, right here. Hello. <laughs> OK, 
Okay, thanks for the follow. Uh, good grief, come on, where are you? I hate it when the zombie noises are and the, you know, the mob noises are like that. You can't figure out where they are. Now, what I am going to do before I get started, I, I don't like leaving a slime running around up here. So it sounds like we're moving away from him if we go this way, right? Enderman, zombies. Oh, I've been, been upstairs for a while. They've been down here congregating, it sounds like. you you know he's probably over in this area I've got a, a little small uh, deal in here and I've had a couple of witches in there crazy as that sounds let's see is this all open oh yeah didn't realize all this was open I guess it's not Really, I mean, it's pretty well lit up, right? Okay, well, you know, no time like the present. Let's go ahead and grab a couple of things that uh, just sitting out here waiting to be grabbed. Uh, he stopped bouncing around, so I'm going to say he's not going to give us any grief. Of course, that's when he sneak up on you. That's when you hit you in the back of the head when you're least expecting it. Oh, I think I'm right over that lava, aren't I? Throw a little torch in there. Oh, and this one. And uh, seal that off. That'll piss him off. You know. Okay. Let's grab. I know I said uh, <laughs> we don't really need a whole bunch of iron, but, you know, who can resist, really? So if you're just joining me, I am the Geeky Minecrafter, and I do a lot of redstone, I do a lot of how-tos, I, I do like building stuff, uh, as a matter of fact, I have an iron golem farm around, uh, around the front of the, uh, front of the property here, to, uh, oh, there was a little lag, so I'm just going to protect that, so I don't walk in that accidentally. Anyway, I have an iron golem farm around the front that is producing quite a bit of uh, iron for me. As a matter of fact, it's producing almost as much iron as uh, I can mine out when I come down here. So it's uh, it's it was definitely worth the investment. Uh, if you want to see how to do it, there's there's several good uh, how tos out on the web. Uh, I I looked at a couple of different ones. Huh. A couple of different ones before I came up with the one I used. Okay, you know what? Let's um, let's see if this one goes all the way down. Now I do, uh, I do like to be safe while I'm mining, uh, so I will close off uh, something to prevent them being able to come into this chamber with me. This slit. Um, I don't like worrying about uh, mobs when I'm mining, so you know I definitely want to keep. Uh, Keep my back door closed, as it were. Now, occasionally, you'll do like this. You'll pop out into, this was actually a, a lava pool, uh, and I cut a slit through. Uh, so once I'm down in here, you know, it's it's possible for them to get to me. Now, I think this is where I ended up because, uh, yeah, I, I mined a bunch of obsidian. I broke the pick I was on. Uh, I had left this one back at the mine. Uh, this is my efficiency five. I saved this one for obsidian. But, you know, today we're going to use it to mine other things. Okay. I know mining, one of the most boring op uh, on visuals or on camera that you can do. But, you know, it's a necessary evil. This is called Minecraft. It's called Minecraft for a reason. Uh, and we do need to be in here uh, doing our thing. I'll leave that open. It's one high. Who, who can get through there? Okay, now when I do hear lava, I do slow down. I hope you do too. Uh, in fact, let me show you what I do when I when I hear lava. Uh, let's go up here. Okay, so I would go one one in, two in, one down, and then mine as far as the pickle reach. And that gives me um, something between me and the flowing lava because I'm not the fastest at moving around. In fact, you know what? Let me uh, let me change the way my hotbar is set up. 
I'm not set up for mining, am I? Uh, okay, so let's do this. So this is one, two, three, four, and my shovel slot. That way, you know, I can hotkey it uh, really fast if I need to. Okay, so since I'm not hearing uh, lava, I can just keep going. Of course, that's when it'll reach up and surprise you. I do like to keep um, keep torches every five or six or seven, probably no more than seven. Uh, that way they can't spawn in here. Now, you know, occasionally you bust out into a cavern and you've got, uh, you've got that to worry about, but, you know, I try to keep that uh, to a minimum. I try to close that off. Okay, I do also like, I know... This is really anal retentive, but I do also like to kind of close this back off. Um, what can I tell you? I did mention I was a geek, right? And a Virgo. A little bit anal retentive or OCD or CD. Uh, okay, I remember where I am now. Right? Yep, yep, yep. Okay, so right in this little chamber I found diamonds. And right up there is water. <gasps> See, like right there. Yeah, this is exactly where I was. Found about five diamonds right here and uh, pushed back. So let's go ahead and light this up. I think, uh, yeah, I hadn't filled this one in. Like I said, it uh, right towards the end, I had a couple things going on. So let me just grab the rest of this. Now this chamber now goes all the way back. Uh, so I'll be able to start the next slit. That, that water was right there. So I do have a, a cavern right above me, obviously, that has water. And I have uh, heard a couple things up in there. Let's see. Let's kind of fill these in. I did mine out a little bit all the way around the diamonds to make sure I wasn't missing any. I think I pulled about seven right out of here. Uh, and if I'm not mistaken, where was it right here? It was just a, an interesting little uh, a cove right up there. I put a torch up there so nobody can uh, spawn in. There we go. Run down to the other end. You'll be able to tell what I've uh, what I've got going down here. Now, I popped out into this cavern on the one down below. Uh, you hear him? I hear him. Let's see. Actually, I should probably... to know there's a cavern right over here. I mean, a really deep cavern that goes quite a ways around. I blocked it off because I don't like to let them in when I'm not down here. Uh, and I am, I think I mentioned I was widening the back back here. Uh, now, here's how I mine. My uh, main channel up at the front part of the mine is three blocks wide. Okay? The back side of my mine is two blocks wide. And then what I'll do is, it, because I always put my torches on the correct side or the, or the same side, I should say, uh, of, the, of the mine. I, he's really close. Because I always put them on the same side, they're on the uh, left, going back to the main part of the mine. So this one's wrong, actually. And this was just here because I was trying to light all this up right here. So going back to the mine, they're on the left. Coming away from the mine, they're always on the right. Uh, and that would be true even down to here. So this is the back side of the mine. And what I want to do is point to the front side of the mine. Now that way, no matter where I pop out, and, and my mines frequently crisscross. They, you know, I cover a lot of ground because you need resources to build some of the bigger projects. So they're pretty good size, and I will... Uh, I will get lost in here. You know, uh, you have channels that cut through. You have back back ends, and uh, it's it's pretty easy to get lost. So, okay, this is the one we came out on. This one doesn't go back, so I'm just going to start this one right back. I'll do a little bit down here every time I come, 
Uh, and, you know, by the time I, I get down to that next level, uh, it'll be in pretty good shape. Just got to put that right there. Again, that's, that's a cavern over there, um, and I am not wanting to go exploring that right now. Jim, uh, uh, J.D. Naz and I spent a little time in there uh, last time we were in. Uh, in fact, uh, <laughs> Jim died once. We, we got overrun a little bit. We had some zombies uh, tearing us up. Had a couple spiders and uh, a bunch of skellies. I mean, it was, it was bad. There was just a whole bunch of creepers. Creepers are crazy. They would sneak up on you and uh, kill you dead. So we just blocked that off. We're going to leave that for now. Okay, so let's back up uh, again. I, I do like to keep things uh, nice and neat. So I am going to go right over this little cavern. And uh, just fill this in. I think I'm hearing uh, skellies in here again. Okay. Got a little dark in here, huh? Sorry about that. I will try to keep it lit up for you and and to keep the uh, the monsters out. Now, since since I am hearing them right down here, and it's maybe not lit up as well as it could be, I am going to go ahead and block off. Again, keep me keep me protected. And yes, I know I have diamond armor on, and yes, I know I should be okay, but, you know, why risk it? Here, it's time to nom nom. <laughs> nom 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 nom. Okay. Got to keep your strength up. Mining is hard work. So, if you would, hang on. <laughs> Okay, I appreciate that. Is it Frodo, Frodo Harders? Uh, channel graphics? Oh, uh, yeah, I might be interested, Frodo. Um, leave me a link. Uh, actually, you can't leave me a link. Um, tell you what, go to my uh, my YouTube channel, Geeky Minecrafter, or my um, Twitter channel, Minecraft Geek or Minecraft Gran, and uh, drop me a link. Let me know you were in on the Twitch channel and that you're. You've got some graphics to uh, for me to consider, and uh, yeah, I'll definitely take a look at what you offer. Uh, I do a lot of my own graphics, but uh, you know who has time anymore? I'm trying to uh, work full time. I'm trying to game full time. I'm trying. I watch watch my mom. She's uh, had some health issues. I'm her caregiver, so you know there's there's just not enough hours in the day to do everything that needs to be done. If you're just joining me, um, I do try to uh, respond to my chat. I, I apologize if I miss your message. Uh, feel free to say it again. Um, I am the Geeky Minecrafter, and we do a lot of redstone. Now, today, I am mining. Oh, do you hear that? I hear lava. Yeah, we're going to slow down a little bit. Make sure. Yep, five is my water. Okay, um, make sure I can get to my water pretty fast. I hate burning up in lava. What is this? Huh. Okay, well, let's, uh, oh no. Yeah, he didn't care for that. You know, I should know better. I remember coming in here earlier and uh, hitting quite a few of those those little silverfish. They are a pain in the butt. Here, let's turn this into obsidian and light it up a little bit. Okay, well, I'm just going to light it up for right now. I, I will change these as I go mining. Uh, I will be mining this obsidian. I think I mentioned before. I'll mention it again. I'll mention it every day until I've got it done. 
I am uh, planning a gold farm. The gold farm uh, is going to need quite a bit of obsidian because I will be mining from pigment. Uh, we'll be bringing them in from the other world into this world, and you need uh, just a truckload of obsidian to make that work. So I will be um, continue mining obsidian until I have everything I need. I'm going to leave that open because it is a channel that I'm going to come back and work on. Uh, let's do this. Oh, look, there's some more iron. I like to be careful when I when I come up to the cobblestone uh, because sometimes for me, cobblestone and a um, torch mean lava. I mean, I found lava, or you know, I, oops, blocked it off because uh, lava was raining down on me. That doesn't work. <laughs> okay, if you're interested, I do have an iron golem farm out front. Uh, if you leave me a message in the uh, chat bar, if you'd like to see it, I will. Uh, what's this? Oh. Another chamber. Goodness, I really hate caving. Seems like every time I try to go caving, something finds me and blows up. Okay. Go in here to get out. Oh, sh <laughs> What did I tell you? What did I tell you? Oh, sorry for screaming like a girl. Good grief. Let's light this up. Good grief. Okay, well, this just goes to show you the investment I made in, oh, diamond armor. Paid off. Good grief. You know what? Um, I'm gonna I'm gonna wait on most of this. I'm gonna wait until I've got somebody here to back me up, uh, like JD Naz or you know my my granddaughter Raven uh, is gonna be joining us on the uh, on the server. Uh, let me see if I can find my way. Let's not say we did. Run, run, run. Run, run, run. I hate creepers. Is he still coming? No? Okay. The spiders can still get in there. Here. Okay. So, good grief. I'm going to put a sign here because <laughs> I can. Uh, cavern. And explored. So if somebody else comes in here, um, like Raven or JD Naz. Uh oh. Okay, here we go. Is this back to where we were? Oh, good grief. There we go. There's the obsidian pool. Oh, you know what? This is not where we came in. This is back into that other cavern. Uh-oh. Get out of here. Oh, yeah. Okay, I know where I'm at now. Remember I told you there was a big old cavern up here? 
This is it. This is this is how you get out. Oh yeah. I can read that one. Okay, so that 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 we were in just wound its way around and back to here. Oh, I cannot believe I didn't take more damage. Let's see. See, and none of it's enchanted yet. I really need some levels. Whew. Scarred me. Okay. I do like playing cooperatively. I like it when there are a couple of other people in here. We can work together and get things done pretty quickly. Uh, mining by yourself. It's a little scary. Let's see. This was... Uh, yes, it was. I'm just going to go ahead and knock that out. And this is where we were, isn't it? Yep, came right in here. Okay, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go right straight through and I'm going to seal it up. Oh, look, I told you we were looking for gold. We found some. Okay, and since this is open on the top, I'm going to clear this up and then seal this up. Again, hate it, hate it when things can drop in on me. And there are so many different ways into that cavern. I'm not worried about losing this entrance. Okay, if you're interested, uh, as soon as we get back to the front part of the mine, I will take you out and show you the iron golem farm. I'm interested to see how much iron we pull out of there while we're in here mining. I've been doing some comparisons, and I am running. It's pretty equal. Um, if I'm down here in mining and I pull out about uh, 40 pieces of iron, when I go upstairs, I've got about 43 from the iron golem farm. So they're, they're running about equal. I did have a really, really good day and pulled about a uh, stack and a half of iron out, hit a large vein, and uh, pulled a stack and a half out. And when I ran upstairs, the iron golem farm had only produced about 48. So uh, unless I get really lucky, uh, they're running, you know, lucky meaning in down with the mine, they're running about even, which is just awesome. Uh, it means every time I'm in world, because my iron golem farm exists in the spawn chunk, the original spawn chunk, which I took great pains to make sure that stayed there. Um, you know that, that we built uh, where we want, where we needed to build. Hold on, don't laugh if I fall on my face. I do this a lot. Okay, so I'll go ahead and start something smelting. carry the rest of this upstairs mm -hmm. and I'll go ahead and clear some of this too. You know, we've got building projects coming up and uh, try to carry up as much as we can. So since zombie pigmen may have come in the uh, back door up here to the portal, I'm going to go ahead and uh, get my sword out. Actually, I should probably eat a little bite. <laughs> now that I happen to know it's probably coming from right over here. This is a big ravine. Again, this, this map is just riddled with ravines. It is crazy full of ravines. So I like to keep... Uh, okay, sorting room. I'll go ahead and drop some of this stuff off. Now I could throw it in the uh, chest, the input chest up front, but... One of the reasons I cut a channel into the sorting room from the exit that goes up to the uh, house is so that I could come in here. Oops. So I could come in here and uh, do a quick drop off and not not tie up the hoppers. You know they've they've got to run. Uh, let's do that. All right. Now the rest of this I may feed in since we're wanting to see the iron golem farm. I think I will. 
Okay, so the input comes down from upstairs right here. So I'll throw this stuff in. Coal I need. Put a redstone in. I don't have one for emerald yet. Um, and then it runs all the way around. Here, let's take a look. Runs all the way down, across, down this way, all the way around, and then this is the um, the overflow. So what's in here? I do not have a um, a filter for down in here. So these are things you know. I'll let them collect, and when I have enough, I'll go in and uh, add additional filters right up here, additional hoppers, hopper chains, and a chest right up here. Oh, see, it's night. Go ahead and sleep. I'll make sure we have our sword out, and I'll show you the um, the golem farm. I'm interested to see how much uh, how much iron we pulled out. Oops. Okay. Oh, yeah. I knew it was kind of early. Come here. Oh, I didn't get those experience points. Dang it. I like it when they're on fire and you can just hit them once <laughs> and they drop their experience balls. It's like, score, freebie. Okay, this is the Iron Golem farm. It is three levels. Each one of these pods contains villagers, anywhere from 20 to 40. Depends on uh, how cooperative they were being at the time. Oh, okay, so today we had more success in the mine than we did at the Iron Golem farm. But, you know, still, 38 pieces of iron that I did not have, and I only have the one pod here. Uh, now, my goal is to build another pod, uh, again, within these borders. That's what these lines right here are, was uh, when I came in world, I found the center point. I found the center chunks. I did all the math. I, I found where the chunks begin and end, and this area within these borders is the end. Well, criminy, my apologies. I recently updated. Oh, good grief. Recently updated my uh, OpenGL and my uh, graphics display cards because uh, I have had some challenges, mostly when I'm running OBS software, so which is the broadcasting software. So I may be looking at an alternative. You see that thing over there floating in the air? Uh, that's my mob farm. And I hesitate to try and take you over there right now because I really hate crashing when I'm out in the world because things can, you know, you're, you're just sitting there until the graphics d driver comes back. You can't see anything. So I really hate to do that. In fact, I'm afraid I may have lost the entire stream and the recording. So one thing I am going to do, uh, oh, sorry, I'm going to offload this, put up my uh, stuff. I'm going to probably stop for a moment, see if I can't um, debug what's going on. I'll try to be back uh, shortly. I had only planned to live stream about an hour, and I've been going, what, about, um, about three quarters of that so far. So... Uh, Got, uh, got a little bit of time. Let me see if I can't resolve this and get right back here. Uh, if you'd like to know when I begin streaming, do uh, click down below, find the follow button. It'll notify you when I am online and streaming. Uh, follow me at Minecraft Grand for Twitter and the Geeky Minecrafter on YouTube. You'll have to do a search for that. I'm not sure what's going on with my channel URL. It says it was, now it's not, so, you know. Do a, do a search for the Geeky Minecrafter. Okay, so um, this is it. I'll be right back if you're interested in hanging around. Uh, if not, catch me next time. Si this is the Geeky Minecrafter signing out.